Why do I hear boss music? Welcome back to another quick little command video. Yes, I know, I'm late, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Red, you're late, I'm sorry! I was busy running uh, the game, as you can tell from my skin. And today I'm going to show you how to make custom boss health bars at the top there. In this case, it is my own health. To give you a little example, if I quickly drop into survival mode... Ow! Check it out! That right there is my health bar going back up. It's pretty neat. I like doing this a lot, and I, uh, I, I am a sucker for custom boss fights, so I'm going to show you how to do this yourself. Okay, step one is making the boss bar. Uh, you know, just boss bar, add whatever you're going to call it in the code stuff, like the commands, and then also whatever you want its display name to be. So... It's like this boss health bar is actually called red health, but it displays as the red MC. So every time I'm talking, but it, it's going to be red health. So next up, you're going to want maybe I'll do that. You're going to want this entire line of command blocks. In this case, uh, you can just slash boss bar set red health and then any number of attributes following that color, max name, player style, value visible. It's super easy. Like this is such an easy command to use. In this case, I've set the color to red. I have set the maximum to 20. So that is how much HP you have. Uh, 20 notch style, which you can do in a number of times, t a number of ways, sorry, 10, 12, 6, stuff like that. And then, uh, visible true, so you can see it. If you, if you toggle that off, so slash boss bar set red health, visible false, well, obviously you can't see it. Lastly, I have, uh, setting its players to everyone, that way everyone in the server or world can see it at the, at the same time. And then all we have to do is track our health with this simple command. You're gonna store the results of a query in the boss bar. So, you know, execute store result boss bar red health value, value. And then you're gonna run the command data get entity the red MC health. But yeah, that command uh, will set the bar's value to our health as I have shown off. And there's one last thing you can do with this, is you can set it to other values. In this case, I have it set to, let me clear this. I have it set to store the result, like same, same command right up until run. Execute if entity at e type equals creeper. Execute if entity returns a number, so in this case there are no creepers in the world, but if I feel like spawning a few, you'll see one, two, three, four, and then, you know. So this isn't just a boss health bar, but it could be a number of enemies left, stuff like that. Basically the way that they do uh, raid health bars, I guess. It looks like one of those. And there you have it, a quick and easy health bar that you can use to store the health of mobs, yourself, a count of mobs, stuff like that. Anything you can imagine, but that is how you do it, and it is a... Uh, a very quick and neat trick. So, thanks for watching. My name is Red, and I will catch you in whatever comes next. I'll see you later.